Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets iOS 14 iPhone and iPad tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a moon phase widget to your iPhone or iPad home screen. So as you can see here on my home screen on my iPhone, I currently have two different moon phase widgets. As you can see, the top one shows a little bit more information, including the name of the phase and sunrise sunset times, which is pretty cool. Now, these are really easy to set up and use and they're also free. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing we need to do is simply open up the iTunes app store on our iPhone or iPad and download and install the Widget Smith app. Once you have the Widget Smith app installed, go ahead and open it up. So basically in this app, you can configure small widgets, medium widgets, and then also large widgets for your phone or your iPad. Now the moon phase widgets are only available on the small and medium size. So just keep that in mind. Now, if you want to get rid of the pre-made widgets, you can quickly do that by just swiping from right to left on the widget and selecting delete, but you can also just select that widget and edit it the way you want it. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to select small number one. And then in here, I'll select default widget. And then under the styling area, this is where we need to pick the moon phase widget. So we're just going to scroll all the way down until we get to astronomy. And as you can see, we have moon phase right there. So just select that. Then at the bottom, you have the ability to change the location. By going to edit location, you can use your current location or even enter something in and search. I'm just going to leave it New York right now. Once you've finished configuring your location, select the back arrow in the top left and then select save. So now we have our widget configured. If you wanted to have the medium size widget, it would be exactly the same. Just select it and then you go in, scroll down to astronomy and select the moon phase. Once you have your moon phase widget configured, we can add it to our home screen by just going back to the home screen long press the home screen background so where there's not any apps until you see your apps wiggle or you see a plus symbol in the top of the screen it'll either be on the right or left side select the plus symbol now in here what we need to do is find widget smith and as you can see right there in the bottom left i can also use the search widget at the top and just type widget and there you go there's widget smith and now depending on the size that we configured. So if you configured small, just select that and then go down to add widget. If you configured me medium, then make sure you have it on that and then go to add widget. So I did small, so I'll select add widget. Then it will add the widget to your home screen. You can move it around to your desired location. And whenever you have it in your location, just tap the background of the home screen and it'll save it there. And now you have a moon phase widget on the home screen of your iPhone or iPad. All right, so that's how you add a moon phase widget in iOS 14 to your iPhone or your iPad. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more iPhone or iPad tutorial videos, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.